everybody, it's Lou. I'm uh, fresh, freshly returned on the Amtrak from Washington, where I was at the satellite, the big satellite conference down there. Uh, we go down there every year to talk about satellites and connectivity and all the things that, uh, that we actually love. But um, some of the takeaways this year was the degree to which satellites have really continued to involve themselves in cities, uh, especially connecting across the digital divide and also um, the degree to which earth observation satellites are helping cities manage their resources, agriculture, water, and so forth. Uh, Hispasat, for example, the big satellite operator over in Spain is connecting rural communities uh, in that region. And so that was uh, really, really exciting to hear about that. Um, there's also a new organization uh, that uh, we'll be involved with, or at least I'll be involved with, that is started by Frank White. For those of you who never heard of Frank, he's the uh, New York Times bestselling author who wrote The Overview Effect, interviews with every person who's left the earth. Um, he and a couple of people are going to be taking a look at creating models for cities when we start inhabiting uh, other planets. Um, and I have to tell you, the early thinking on that, the early work is that they're going to look an awful lot like intelligent communities and smart cities. So uh, that was another uh, topic there. The final one that really um, is kind of technical but really important is that there's a move on uh, for a digital interoperability standard through a consortium that's been put together. And I can talk more about that last uh, next time. But what's going on there is that we're going to be creating standards for uh, companies, the governments, and others for transmission through satellite. But I'm going to talk more about that next time because that's, um, that's kind of heavy stuff. But uh, that's what's going on in the world of satellite. That's actually a little bit of what's going on. And um, remember, even in space, there's no place like home.